Hello everyone, welcome back to Empyreon Galactic Survival Reforged Eden 2 Beta Testing. In today's episode, what we're going to do is we are going to shove some stuff in the old factory. Um, so that we might be able to bring in some other ship of sorts. So we're going to go and we're going to shove as much materials as we can into the factory wafer. We did get the safety and we needed. The only thing I'm not putting in there is that. Neo can go in there. Wood can go in there. That can go in there. That can go in there. That can go in there. If you notice, I made an insulation booth. Um, problem is. We need to unlock something real quick for the small vessel. The armor locker. Because you can't put it on without an armor locker and I don't want to run out of resources just waiting to throw it in there. Or did I just hose myself here? Electronics and computers. Electronics and some computers. Electronics and some computers. I got advanced electronic. Keeping that, keeping that. Keeping that. That. I can come down here for now. Don't worry, I'm gonna empty that out here in a second. Alright. So, what if we put all this in there? Won't fit. What are we missing? We can get an armor locker. We have one armor locker. Alright, where are we going to put it on the ship? Guarding the fridge? Yeah. Insulation boost on. Alright, let's empty this bad boy out. Actually, hold on. Let me manage. Right. So we need to get rid of all the stuff that we can here. That constructor is full. I don't know what those are used for. I don't need night vision goggles. I'm just emptying out the cargo. Those can all go over here in this box. I'm going to name this my ingot box for now. All the ingots that we get. So we can actually start organizing a little bit. Grabbing the ingots out, ingots out of everywhere. I'm putting the ingots in the box here. Now on the other side of this thing is another box, which I put most of the undelivered cargo. Well, when we go to hand in the undelivered cargo, I will not do it on camera. It's just painful. It's the dialogue box is just eh, atrocious. All right, I think, I think it's all. I think it's all out. I don't think there's anything in the fridge, is there? Let's go and look in the fridge. Now that we buried behind stuff. Yeah, there was stuff in the fridge. Throw the milk in there, that in there, that in there. Actually, the bars can come out. All this stuff can go in there. Carbon substrate can come out of there. That's kind of an ore. 
drop that in there. So we're up to a little bit of ore. We have more titanium than we have anything else right this second, but there might be titanium. We already threw the titanium into the factory. All right, let's see what we need to go grab from the asteroids. And we'll take off. Let's see. We got the satium emerald pentaxid. How much emerald pentaxid are we talking about here? Hold on, let me see here. Two. Can we make emerald pentaxid in this thing? Not that one, but this one. Can we make emerald pentaxid? No. I am going to take that with me, though. I think I can do it in the mobile constructor. Let's throw it in there real quick. Emerald pentaxid. No. You can't. You can't make emerald pentaxid. You can make ref Oh, there it is. So one gives us what? Well, let's turn the power on here real quick. Four. Alright, that's all we needed. <laughs> Alright, so now we need Neo and Cobalt. Turn the ship off, please. We're gonna do some stuff here. That's keep that in there. Fill up the... We're getting there. Alright, so we need cobalt, right? Plastic tubing. Electronics. Cobalt alloy. Let's just dump everything into the factory other than the bars. Tit well, I'm going to keep back some titanium plate. Another undelivered cargo. I made a base starter block, but then I said, no, I don't need to use it. <laughs> All right. What else can we throw in there? I think this one's the better one. No, this one. We can throw those in there. We can throw those in there, we can throw those, 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 those. Hmm. We don't have a lot of loot. We can throw those in there. 5.56, that sounds familiar. I'm going to keep both of those. Advanced computers. Neo. Demand. Light armor might be able to be thrown in there. Oh, he doesn't want the light armor. Alright, so we've thrown, thrown as much as we can into... The factory with what we have. Let me go see if there's any Neo over here. Because I think we're going to be shy on Neo. Satium, gold. Yeah, there's no Neo over here. How are we doing on carbon substrate, though? That's another thing that's a big ticket item that we might need to mine out. 14,000. I need copper, too. How many bars of copper are in here? 10? Got a lot more scrapping to do. Alright, let's go to outer space now. We have a drill, we have, we have an EBA boost, we have some ammunition if we're just in case we get in trouble. So yeah, 
let's turn on the thrusters. Look in the fridge just to make sure we don't need to look in the fridge. All right, let's go. See if we can't find some asteroids to munch down. Actually, let's go we're exploring. We made it off the dreaded world for the second time. Iron asteroid. I entered atmosphere again, didn't I? Yep. Get away from the atmosphere. Could have sworn I saw an iron around here somewhere. There's an iron asteroid. Map. We are going to go warp and see what we can see over in Epsilon 2. Seven AUs over there, huh? All right, let's go. Abandoned oxygen tank. I wonder what that has on it. What's it look like? Did I just lose a ball? I felt like I just lost a ball. Hmm, maybe not. I didn't hear the gunfire off the oxygen thing. Let's go to the planet. I want to see about our radiance and POIs. We'll get our Neo that way. Yes, we have an EVA boost on. Yes, we can take it off for the armor locker. We should have made a medic chamber. The only good POYs right now are just the depot. If they get changed, they're not going to be worth doing either. Burnt out recon vessel. Hmm. We'll check out some of that stuff when we have a shield and a ship to protect us. Of course, it could get valuable loot on it. Maybe we'll find a crash capital vessel here. Wow, that loaded in. Unknown faction. Players Negacorp, huh? Where are they? I wouldn't mind out the Neo on the planet. Wow, it's a little buggy right now. Because things are spawning in. For the first time. It's usually laggy whenever it comes online. How big is this planet? That's kind of big. It is kind of big. That's okay. We just want to explore. Maybe get some iron. There's two drones guarding all that. I have ammunition, but not tons.
I haven't even made myself a pulse rifle yet. Hold on, we found something purple. Mm-hmm. Let it be the abandoned depot. So we know we have an abandoned depot we can run every day. Endgame days, by the way. I don't know what it is. What is it? Abandoned drone base. What a joke. Or the abandoned mine. Uh, yeah. That, that POI is a joke now. Not even worth running. I know you can get quantum processors and whatnot. And we'll eventually run that POI. We might be a four-parter though, because it, it does have a, a couple puzzles in it that you have to solve. The drone. Two drones. Three drones. And get up higher. I'm made out of paper. <laughs> I don't want to blow up yet. Not until we get at least the um, Wayfarer in. Alright, let's go this way. I'm going to put on cruise control. Playing in his life is what my friend, good friend Major told me. Get that XP from his bling and every, everything I uncover is 200 XP. 210 XP actually. Only if I was digging out planetary deposits. <laughs> I could be mining out all this whole planet. But I told my friend Major I was going to try to only use asteroids in, in the game. Excuse me. Ooh, lots of blingies. What level are we at? Well, level 15. Everything's loading in, everything's going real slow. Bling! Bling! 4,050 XP just from discovering all those buildings. <laughs> I think that's broken. Ellen Farm. There's a player's area over here. I would do the storyline, but I don't like the storyline. It kind of left it off in a weird way. I'm not going to give you any spoilers, though. Trees. Where have you been to my life, trees? Is there any surfix rocks down here? Because that's definitely not mine on the planet. Yeah, let's keep going. Let's see what's over in the player's area. Huh. Vehicle station, huh? Okay. We need to go this way. Go back on cruise control. Go up in the air a little bit. Level up. Voyage of Discovery. What will we find underneath this planet of goodness? Probably better O2 concentration. <laughs> T 
See, why put rich and plenty on if you're just gonna get small deposits? That makes absolutely no sense. It's like the game is like handicapping you. I mean, I, I get it. I, every planet can't have large deposits on it. Like, that one's a medium. See, that's what rich and plenty should be, is medium deposits. That copper back there was a small deposit. That Neo's a medium deposit, I guess. Mm, rich and plenty is better, I guess. Could be a whole bunch of small deposits. There's some Promethean. More Neo. Neo. It's a Polaris drone. That's a cool looking building. I do have a couple of videos from the Chaos Crew that I plan on uploading. I just don't know when right this second. Let's go, come on. Let's go. Give me some purple POIs. Any day now. I, see, this is what I don't get. Look how much land mass is in between you and a POI. Is there anything even there? Can you imagine traversing the sands of this planet and all you find is giant worms? There's a rock spire over here. I'm gonna go take it down because I, I really want. Whoop. No, 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 no. Back. I want the rock spire. It's gonna give us a lot of crushed down. And it's good XP too. You watch, I'll show you once we get drilling into it. I'm sure there's nothing around us to kill us, yeah. Let's go up to it. Almost taking it down. 2,475 XP and um, a metric ton of stone. 442 stone. That ain't bad for one spire. 2,075 XP though. That is ridiculous. You get less XP for discovering buildings than you do chopping down the rock bait, rocks like that. I mean, if we find some more rocks, I might do it just to get the graphite we need. Or the carbon substrate we need for the um, wayfarer. I know we're gonna get plenty of um, stone when we start mining the asteroids out, but that's a little later in the in the day. I want to show you guys the shipyards. I want to show you guys a lot of things that I, I haven't shown before in the video that are in-depth stuff that you could go and make your life a little easier in Imperium. But just know, you need 50,000 
50 tiles and wow well, we ran around in circles Did we go back the way we came yes so might as well keep heading this way away from the drone base though yeah he nerfed that drone base I know it's probably got three or four epic containers in it but it's a really hard POI now Which is good for a challenge, but when it takes two hours to get through it, it's like, eh. Maybe we could run it faster if we had better weapons. I think I I ran it with somewhat okay weapons. And it took me two hours and I died 14 times. Ah, the cover of darkness. Another band in runes. Cruising along here. Nothing in the distance. What's this? What father is that? What do we need? Neo, cobalt, copper, and carbon substrate. Is there any carbon deposits on this planet? I wonder. Is there any graphite planet? There's no graphite here. There's Neo. Ooh, another purple POI. Actually, two purple POIs. One in the distance, and there's a depot. Good to know on that one. Do we run it in the next episode or not with light armor? I'm afraid of drones. Coming in and shooting my ship up while I'm in there. And I don't have a lot of medical, the, uh, medical stuff on me. Watch this be another depot. Nah, it's an abandoned drone base. <laughs> we have another abandoned drone base. Let's keep heading at east. Definitely don't want to go over that way. That's Xerox territory. Hmm. Nothing on the horizon yet. Yeah, let's go up and make a right. Let's go north. My main goal is to get to Akuba, build an epic base. Go out, attack some, some Carveras, and then that'll be the series. The base is going to be a mountain base because I really want to try out and see if I can't get a mountain base going that looks pretty cool. I got to start using the angles of glass and whatnot. I do want a mega farm, but with it taking bone to make the nutrient solution, you're better off going to um, the dreaded planet or an undead planet where it has lots of grow plots. And you just go in there and you just grab the nutrient solution and make your own steel grow plots. Cannon room. go north still. Let's go east. But yeah. 
Going after the nutrient solution is easy. Just go to the Planet Dread and just, especially if you're not running re regenerative POIs. If you're not ready and you're doing regenerative POIs, you might as well just take the Grow Plus up and hold. But with regenerative POIs, you can't do that. You have to salvage it. You can salvage it and do take apart or don't salvage it, but put it in there. Put it in like retrieve block and see if you can get a couple retrieved. That might save you some money. And a headache. Yeah, I don't see anything out here. I'm gonna go near mine some Neo uh, in between episodes. I'm gonna go out to the asteroid field and just munch into an asteroid until I get all that I need. <laughs> or we can do it on camera. This is just an exploration video today. Um, to see where it's out here. We know there's a depot and a couple of abandoned drone bases now. That's an oxygen refinery, if I won't say so myself. Yeah, oxygen processor. Keep up in the air just to be on the safe side. Is that Polaris or is that Pirates? Looks like Polaris. Get a little closer. We need the XP. Started the day off at 15 and we're already 16. We will definitely be running a lot of POIs because the fact that you can only get quantum processors from defeating POIs gives a whole new meaning to grind. I think I need 60 of them to bring in the attack ship that I want to bring in. So that's 30 POIs we have to raid. And it's not always guaranteed. It's supposed to be guaranteed you get two every time you run a POI, which if you divide 60 and a half is 30 times you would have to run a POI. And I want to show you the progression. Data Center. Any rock spires around here? No. We'll get to level 25 pretty soon. It's just a matter of time. We already did this portion. We're straight ahead. We haven't done this area. Map. Yep. Head. Heading straight that way. Maybe turn in a little bit to. Let's go right about there. Level off with the O key and blink. See some rock spires coming up. Ooh, zero X territory. Yeah. We're going to avoid that. Paper ship. I don't want to be stranded on this planet. Because that would force me to make um, or uh, mine out resources. And I do not want to do that. We're going to give the Xerox people their space. We 
can make friends with the Z-Rex. Not too hard. Just don't shoot any of the drones down early game and let the rep build up. Actually, we need to discover the raid. The did we discover the Xerox action? Let's see real quick. No. So we gotta discover the Xerox. So we're gonna go over here and discover the Xerox. Come on, give me another race. All right. Want to go this way. Now we've discovered them, right? Yep. We're hated by them. Come on, find something. Take an assembly yard any day now, unless he took them out of the game, because me and my friends haven't found an assembly yard <laughs> yet. It's just fan depots, abandoned mines, abandoned factory, abandoned drone base. Whichever ones they are now. That's another Xerox installation. Let's go this way. Level off. I've really seen too much to loot. We might think about the depot. Once we get the Wayfarer in. You know, we need to focus on going into the shipyards and getting goodies that I'll show you. But to get those goodies, you have to sell thrusters and whatnot. And to sell thrusters, you need Neo. And if you need Neo, you got to go mine it. You need Neo, Cobalt, and Iron, and something else to make medium ion thrusters, which you can sell to the vendor at the shipyard. And then once you get your first license, the rest of it, it's all downhill after that. You'll, you'll get tons of, uh, tons of materials to sell back to them to make a, get another license. I'll show you, don't worry. We're going to be doing a lot of them probably. Iron deposit. Just realized my oxygen was going down. Let's not let the oxygen get too low. <laughs> yeah, I suffocate myself again. Have I died yet? Nope. <coughs> Let's keep it that way. Alright, everyone. Uh, in the next episode, we're going to do some mining. We're going to go to outer space. We are going to mine out tons of resources. We are going to get the Wayfarer in in the next episode. That's my main goal. Is to get it in. Get the Wayfarer in. We may actually have to go to a planet and mine out some graphite. Because... We need another 10,000 of it. I mean, Crushed Stone's going to give you some. We'll see. We'll see how many asteroids we can do. How many asteroids we can um, munch up before the 30 minutes or the 40 minute tag is up. All right, everyone. This is where I'm going to call this video, everyone. I do hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you didn't, make sure you storm that like button. 
And if you're new here, subscribe for more daily videos. I hope everyone take care. Bye-bye. Thanks to all my Patreons and YouTube subscribers.